Hello and welcome to NanoHub U's introduction to bioelectricity. I'm Professor Pedro Rithoki at Purdue University and I want to talk to you about this course and encourage you to sign up for it. In the course you're going to learn a series of things. We're going to begin by giving you a rough overview of neuroanatomy and how electrical signals in the brain work to form circuits. Then we're going to go into modeling how that works with mathematical equations and we're going to learn how to write programs, a Python program, to model in real time and calculate the numerical solution of the differential equation known as Hodgkin-Huxley's equation. It's an approximation of electrical activity in a neuron. You're then going to start to learn about how you can use that information to begin to understand the implantable medical devices that are being developed today for diseases like epilepsy, Parkinson's disease, that are being developed to be able to monitor the intention of the body to move and restore motion with robotic arms and robotic legs to our injured warfighters, for example. And so the culmination of the course really is that you're going to build this device. This is a Raspberry Pi based device that you're going to design and build an analog front end for. That's a circuit that will record an electrical signal from your body. It will transmit it wirelessly to the computer, your laptop, after it's amplified and digitized, and you'll learn how to do all of that. And this will then couple to electrodes that you'll put on your arm, like I have here. You'll have a ground electrode on your wrist. You'll have two recording electrodes placed longitudinally on your arm. And then you can see on the screen up here on my left that you have streaming data of the electrical activity, in this case, in my arm. So if my arm is relaxed, you see a nice flat line response. If my arm contracts, you see a contraction. I relax, I contract, I relax, I contract. So you'll be able to do this too. You'll build the device, the device will wirelessly communicate with your laptop, it'll record a bioelectric signal, in real time, it'll correspond with the models that you've developed previously in the course, and then you'll be able to use the wireless device that you build to record your bioelectric signals to control a prosthetic arm in the same way that we use these devices in the clinic to control robotic arms in our injured veterans. So it's going to be a great semester, 16 weeks. You're going to learn a ton, and at the end of it, you're going to really have a solid foundation in bioelectricity, what it means, why it's important, and how you use bioelectric signals to develop cutting-edge medical devices. I look forward to seeing you in the course.